Hey, good morning, YouTube. It's King Ranger 13. Welcome back to another video. If this is your first time watching, thank y'all so much for watching. Hopefully, y'all enjoy some of the content today, and hopefully, y'all follow along and hit that like and subscribe button. Before we get going, let's start the truck up. All right, so I've got my checkbook with me this morning for good reason. Maybe time to add something else to the fleet. On top of everything else we've been adding to the fleet here lately, comical, honestly. But I gotta do what I gotta do. Here's a little hint. Got the trailer hooked up. Looks like a pretty good work unit. Pretty darn good. All right, we're heading up to town. Got the trailer hooked up. First tow on the new truck. Got the wife with me. We're gonna head up and get a little uh, breakfast date action there. Then we'll slide over to the other side of town to Look at this new deal here, so I gave you a little hint with the trailer. I guess y'all just have to hang out for a little bit and see what we get. Summer, what do you think of the new platform? I think it's definitely not the dually, but I do like it. What do you like about it that's different from the Okay, Irish? well honestly what I really did notice, the, what I noticed as different was the seats. The seats are more comfortable for sure. Really? Yeah. You think these seats are a lot more plush than the camera yeah, seats? Yeah, I do. Wow. Actually. Well, looks like uh, maybe later on we'll have to do a comparison of King Ranch seats versus Platinum seats. In my opinion, the King Ranch seats are... These are, these more... are like softer. Like, okay. there's more, um, I don't know, bounciness to them. I don't, I don't know, in a, in a way, there's more back support on this one and I don't know if it's just how the seat is adjusted, like you can pump air into the yeah. back and stuff like I, that. I think the seat needs to be adjusted probably. But, I mean, there's some deep differences I'll show you here. So, the AC vents along this, is this trim right here, it's kind of got like a brushed metal look, a uh, brushed metal look here too. It's covered with plastic right now, it's still got the doo doo. And then along here on the center console, it's got this like brushed metal looking kind of cloth deal here. And then the doors, uh, this is instead of that wood, that brown wood, um, it's got like a black kind of carbon wood or something like that. These are gray. And then this is brushed metal as well. So yeah, just some little differences there. And then of course, uh, oh yeah, that, that's brushed metal, which is very, very cool. And then the back seats, the same blend of all. There we go. There we go. A lot safer, right? Yes. Okay. They're both very similar trims uh, as far as like options, but just got key little differences there, like the brushed metal look and, and uh, the K-Range obviously has some of the accents and things like that. Um, where the Platinum doesn't. So, but that's the cool thing about it is the different trims have like a unique thing to it. Cool story about this truck with these tires. These mud grapplers that you're hearing right now are the ones that were on the 2020 F250 King Ranch when I sold it because he took them off, sent them aside, and then I called him when I was swapping trucks out with him. And he said that he had them laying over and uh, over to shop or whatever and so I just asked him to put them on here so kind of funny how the tires I bought a while back have come back around so pretty neat but first CC's let's see another drip <laughs> oh wow Oh. 
So, you excited to go get this thing? Don't say anything about it because I haven't told them oh. what it is. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I am. That's all you gotta say. I, I, <laughs> I'm few of words this morning. Short of words, or I guess. <laughs> A little brekkie action. Uh, mug of sippy. Sausage. Breakfast. Croissant. Some coffee. Yogurt. Yogurt. About a mile away. All right, here we go. Where is it at? He said... Ah, okay. Where is it? <laughs> there it is. What do you think, Sar? Looks good. Ah. Alrighty. It's high. Low. Alright. Try to unload. quick uh, before we get going uh, big shout out to blackbird off-road for helping us out with this six by six awesome guy brandon he's the owner and his two sons run it first time i met him and really cool guy very respectable guy make sure y'all go to his new shop and check out his stuff or give him a call check him out on facebook i'll put a link right here or somewhere around here uh, and his phone number where you can reach out to him if you need anything especially around the northeast louisiana area or shoot if you see something on his facebook um, page there that you want come and get it let him know that king rancher sent you and uh maybe you'll get a hundred dollars off or i don't know you figure that out with him so i just want to give a big shout out to them uh check them out on facebook make sure to like their page and follow them all righty got the side by side unloaded Take it for a quick spin earlier. Looks pretty mean. It's got toolboxes for tools. Maybe I'll put my Yeti on this or something. Toolbox there. And then, oh, the cool thing. It's got a snorkel that comes out into here that the previous guy did. So that's pretty neat. And awesome thing is all the lights work. Like everything on this thing works. The winch works. A winch is a brand new winch on it. Brand new Super ATV 5000 winch. Uh, light bar. 
uh, up top works, headlights work, uh, six by six works. Um, only got 300 hours on it. I mean, things in pretty good condition. What would you say? Driving. Well, it drives a lot better in grass than on pavement. Obviously, but, uh, I mean, it drives pretty good. I mean, it can't go too fast because, so if you look here, it's got gear reduction in it, so you can't go as fast. So, I mean, everything on this thing is pretty clean and done right. But, anyways, guys, that's gonna be it for this video. Hopefully, y'all like the new rig uh, used for this hunting season. Um, can't really find anything right now so this is what we got let me know down in the comments below what y'all think about it i'd love to see what y'all think until next time guys peace out